Hey guys, what's up? In this chapter of my ex hired a hitman, which is called Part 8, talking about the kill, it literally picks up exactly from Part 7. So they are still at the Moonlight Diner. The hitman asks Curtis where did he get his number and his whereabouts. Curtis informs him about his friend Andrew. Now the thing intriguing and also intense about this chapter is the intimidation of this man, especially from his physical and how Curtis deals with it. I mean, there's no doubt about it. He's afraid of him. The minute Curtis mentions his best friend's name, the HM laughs and basically tells him, oh, that's the one that flaked out. <clears throat> Which only means that maybe Andrew must have gave him this number as a test. As the conversation between these two strangers continue, he realizes from previous jobs and situations and experience this man takes his job very seriously, and this right here is the real deal. I didn't want to give the hitman a name. I think it actually made him more mysterious in a scary way. Since he takes his job so serious, he asks Curtis, what does he want to do? Why does he want to do this? And explains first and then elaborates more. At the end of the conversation, he gives him the money. And well, this deal is on.